Hi everyone, I'm Christina. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to make chicken with snow peas stir fry. I got all my snow peas from my backyard garden. Let's start to prepare all the ingredients. For snow peas, there's some fiber on both sides of the pot. Peeling off the extra fiber on both sides of the snow peas, like what I show you here. These steps will make the snow peas more tender for sure. Then clean them and set them aside. I mince two cloves of garlic. Now I'm going to prepare the chicken. I got one piece chicken, about half pound. Cut the fat off the chicken. And cut the chicken into small pieces. Then put them into a bowl. Next, I'm going to marinate the chicken. I put one tablespoon of vegetable oil, one tablespoon of cornstarch, one tablespoon of light soya sauce, a little bit of black pepper, and one tablespoon of cooking wine. Mix them well and set it aside. Now I'm going to prepare the slurry. One tablespoon of cornstarch, add one third cup of water mixed together. This is used to thicken the sauce later. Now I'm going to make the sauce. I use one tablespoon of oyster sauce, quarter teaspoon salt, one third teaspoon sugar, a little bit of black pepper, one tablespoon of light soya sauce, one third teaspoon chicken powder, Add one third cup of water, mix them well and set it aside. Now I'm going to prepare some carrots. I cut about 10 slices of carrot. If you don't have any carrot at home, skip these steps. I use carrot because I want my dish to look more colorful. Without the carrot, the snow peas still taste very good. Now let's start to cook. Heat up the pan, put some vegetable oil into the pan. Heat up the oil and put the chicken into the pan. Stir about 2-3 minutes until it is done and nice brown color and set it aside. Now I'm going to boil some water. Pull about 1 teaspoon salt, 1 tablespoon vegetable oil into the water. Put all the snow peas and the carrot into the wok. When the water reboil, scoop all the snow peas and the carrot out from the boiling water. Don't boil too long, otherwise the snow peas will get too soft and won't crunchy and not taste as good. These steps will keep the snow peas nice green color when it is done. Heat up the wok and put two tablespoons of vegetable oil into the wok. Put the minced garlic into the wok, then put the snow peas back into the wok. Stir fry for about half minute in high heat. Then add the pre-mixed sauce into the wok. Mix them well. Then put the chicken back to the wok, mix with all my snow peas. Now slowly add the slurry to thicken the sauce. Now the snow peas are done and ready to serve. I hope you give this recipe a try and I hope you like it. Thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe and share. See you in my next video.